How's it going guys? Welcome back to another Fallout 4 episode. Uh, you guys have been great. I uh, just want to thank you for your support. So let's get some shout outs on the way. Uh, Harris Benabdel Jilil says, God that's a mouthful. Uh, good job on that one. Best Fallout Let's Play on YouTube by far. I appreciate that. Thank you very much. And David says, epic video. Love the series. Love this series. Okay, thank you David. Supermoose 7 says, thank you dude. I'm not able to see the game myself, so getting to see you travel through it like this, building up the character and the realistic style of play, is the bee's knees, man. Truly appreciate it. Oh, that's cool, man. Love that message. Um, Martina says, yay, another video. Thanks, a few smiley faces there. Uh, the God Cave, please start being nicer to people in dialogue. The world is already such a terrible place without your sour attitude. Sarcasm is the lowest form of wit, remember. True, very true in real life. Um, now, but the reason why I do it is because I'm just kind of just role playing it. My uh, character's, you know, he just found out he's over 200 years old. His wife's dead and his son's missing, so he's going to be a little bit upset. Uh, the giant geek gamer says, can you please make more forest videos? I would I would love to please everybody but the truth is it's, it's kind of run its course it doesn't mean it's necessarily over though so we could go back to that eventually uh, Alex says uh, keep up the good work okay cool we will do we will do uh, let's get this uh, base building going because we've got so much that we need to do so let's crack on okay here we go what we're going to do is we're going to build a walkway going right across this road and then we're going to gate it off as well that's the plan if i sound a little bit different it's because i'm a little bit bunged up right now but uh anyway that's not the point we're here to build this base and we've got so much that we need to do it's going to take a long time so let's get to cracking uh I'm going to rip this wall out because this is where the walkway is going to be. We'll just dump this over here for now. I could store it, but uh, I don't want to forget that it's there. And I mean, I don't want to store too much and wind up forgetting that I've got certain things. So let's find the right build for what we're going to do. Uh, no. Too big, too big. None of these. I have a rule. I always keep it basic to begin with. This could work. This one. There we go. Oh, we got a level up as well. That's handy. And one more. That should do it. Looks cool. Looks cool. Okay, these are. I'm going to use these as some sort of like a like a support. Um, because I don't like floating bases. I wonder if we can... Oh, fuck it. We'll do it in a bit. Let's just finish off what we're making first. I want to quickly build... I want to use these as for defence purposes. So, I want to be able to shoot from this walkway onto the road. So, let's put that there. And that's one there. Double it up, keep mixing it up, not using the same one because we want it to look like it's been built by amateurs. There we go. Voila, one more. Voila. Okay, it took me a while to figure out how I was going to do this, but this is how we're going to do it. We're going to have a little door here with we'll walk up, simples, come up the stairs, and we've gained access to the walkway here. We just need something here to make it feel more useful. Okay. Damn, these are so... These are so temperamental. 
slightest little movement makes them red and you can't mute, put it down. Just keep moving slowly. Is that done it? And we can use these to fill up the gaps as well. A little tip for you guys. There we go. Man, I feel as rough as a brulo right now. There we go. Right. Let's oh, put this last one on the other side as well. There we go. Okay, looking good. Looking good. Eventually, we're going to fence this off completely. I don't want to just build a base. I want to build a community. I want to outdo Diamond City, that's the plan. I want this to be the place that everyone comes to. Let's scrap these real quick. Okay, now we need access to the top of the walkway. This could work, this could work. The roof is a bit shit. I might have to flatten it. I put a floor down instead of a roof. I don't know. Stays hidden forever. Looks good though. Okay. I've decided I'm going to build a uh, a tower, a sniping tower, so that I can shoot off. Just trying to figure out how I'm going to do this. Let's put down the stairs. These ones. Why is it not snapping? <laughs> I don't know why I'm using these ones. Uh, let's put another floor down. Actually, I've got a better idea. If we're going to do that, we might as well make the tower a little bit taller. Gotta get this right. Okay, we can straighten that up now. <coughs> there we go. go it snaps there look at that perfect walk up look around kill some fuckers yeah we're g'd up let's get some of these for defense purposes just along the top here so we're able to shoot from inside the walkway and on top of the walkway so that's pretty badass okay Eventually, I'm going to flatten this roof down. Look up. See the enemy. Pop him. Simples. Yeah, it's badass. Basic, but effective. Pop. Most folks are just looking for a hand. All we gotta do is... Okay. Got some lights, we've got some power going. Okay, I've got another idea. I'm gonna put a wall here and then I'm gonna push a balcony onto this walkway just in front here to sort of separate the two. What's that doing there? Oh shit. What the fuck was that? Okay, that was a bit weird. go yeah yeah looks good looks good looks good
Let's get another one. Go all the way across. Why is that not snapping there? I think we can just get away with it and do it like that. And we can put these on there. Like so. What's going on there? It's that damn gate at the bottom. I'm gonna have to push this forward. Let's bring this out. Okay, I've decided we're gonna use these huge double doors. I completely forgot these were even in the game. If I'd have known this, I would have used these to begin with, so we're gonna put this down instead. works. Let's get these out of the way. Okay, we need to... Hmm. Let's put two of these down either side of the gate. Because you can assign your settlers to these, these uh, defense posts. And they'll stand up there and guard. So we have one there. Out of the way. And we're going to put this one here. Let's move this. Pylon's in my way. Let's put this bitch over here for a minute. Okay, let's try that again. Oh, shit. Okay. Get it nice and tight. Oi. that back a little bit. See if it in lines with the other one and it does. Excellent. Okay, a little trick of mine I'm gonna share with you guys now. To build a platform because you can't do this without this foundation. It's a little bit off there. Put that back down, bring this over slightly. Okay. Put that there. Voila. Remove this. Like so. Take this gun turret. Put it there. Oh yeah. Tell your friends. We got creative. It works. And then we can do this on the other side as well. Another support beam here. Because we don't want floating bases. Come on, you bitch. Here we go. Whoa, it's way out. Let's move it across. Oh, yeah. Well, oh, that looks cool now. We just got to sort out these power cables because they're a bit of a mess right now. We just store them for the minute until we figure out how we're going to do this. Let's take this one as well. It's all a bit crisscross at the minute. Holy shit! We're being attacked for the first time. Oh fuck! Get back! Get back! Get back! Shit, I've got no ammo. Oh, did you see Jun Long then? Coming with the punch. Damn, they're coming in from the rear. This has completely changed the game for me now. This has changed everything. I thought they only uh, attacked from the front. Fuck, we're gonna need turrets and everything back here. Feral ghouls. Sorry lot indeed. To lose one's mind slowly. Like yeah. Shit. This has changed everything now. Let's get rid of these fuckers. Oh, 
this area is where I store the uh, leftover objects. I could press... Get here, you bastard. Yeah. Give me your caps. Bitch. Okay guys, we're just customising the uh, armour suit real quick. We was going to have the military paint, but it takes up a lot of ingredients, so we're just going to use this hot rod paint that I've got. And we can do the whole thing. It doesn't require any, any materials. Yeah. Oh yeah. Looks badass. We've also got this suit here which we get to touch, but uh, I'm gonna be like Tony Stark up in this bitch. Yeah. Okay, the guys are needing water, so uh, the little pumps aren't just gonna do it, so we're gonna get this water purifier. We'll stick it over here in the river. Uh, let's put that here. Which way should we have it? Let's have it this way. Looks better looking. Now we need a generator. Keep it simple. There we go. And now a switch pylon. Let's wire this bitch up to there and then to this one. And we've got water, people. Cool, cool, cool. This is good because we can switch it off when we need to and switch it back on when we, when we need to, so... Pretty sick. Fuck yeah. Okay, guys, this here. I've designed a small bathroom here. I've used this side of this house here to look like it's got tiles. So it gives it quite a cool effect. Like so. Let's, uh... Get some stuff for it. Female and male. This is for both sex. Bring that down. For some reason, the male one is hiding his head. Maybe the others? Oh, I don't know. Okay. It's going to have to go here. And then we bring that one lower. It's got to be the same. Equality and all that shit. Notice employers must wash hands before returning to work. So. Yeah, I'm not sharing tools with a guy who has feces on his hands, so. Let's put that there. We'll have a few of these around. Hello. Toilet. Put it on the tiled wall so it kind of looks connected. We'll do the same again for this. Flip that around. Pipe work on the tiled wall. There we go. Little table there. Let's straighten this out a little bit. I know it's a little bit crooked anyway, but still. Okay. Some shelves for all the tampons. And this, this is like a seating area for those who are waiting to use the shitter. Um, which makes sense, I guess. So if you see anyone sitting on those chairs, that means they're waiting to go to the toilet. Be quite funny. Okay, I've got a new build here. So far, I'm not too sure what I'm going to use it for. So far, the only thing I can think of is beds. Uh, I'm trying to make a, a deck in here as well. So like the first floor is going to be all open plan. And then it's going to have an upstairs that's obviously going to be sealed off with beds. Let's just move this over here. There we go. It's going to be a bit of a challenge trying to build in between two houses though because it's going to be very restricting. Fuck, what's going on here? Come on boy. Snap for me. There we go. Okay, I'm not liking this actually, it looks a little bit too much flowing on air right now. 
I'm going to probably take these off. Yeah. Take these off for the minute. So that's just going to be the basic layout. That's as much as I can get away with. Okay. Got a doorway, a balcony area. That's going to be the balcony area here. So let's see if we can get a wall in there. I don't know if we can get this wall in there, it looks a bit thick. Let's try something a bit more skinny. Yes, it works. And this side, again keeping all the walls different. Come on, don't do this to me here. So I stopped recording and I started recording and now this is the layout that we got. This is what I could get away with. This will be the bedroom area. It's pretty small really for a lot of building, I'm not going to lie. Then we've got this balcony here that we can shoot off, which is pretty cool. Okay, I've done the furniture. And... We just need a door. I removed it because it was in the way. I want to show you something else as well that I'm working on because we can get stores now. Let me just walk up here and then walk back down. There we go. Yeah, so we've got some stores built over here. Let me uh, quickly show you. We've got the medical center on the right, and we've got a clothes store here, which we need to furnish. Also, we need to get a roof on it as well. Let's do that now. Let's go inside, yeah. So you walk in, go up the stairs. This is going to be like the... This is where they're going to be sleeping up here. Okay, let's get some furniture in here. We'll have suitcases. We're going to have all the finest clothes in here. See if we can move these. Nope, we'll have to do it in build mode. That's okay. Okay, we'll pile them up in the corner. Can we put them on there? No. Okay, we'll pile them up here on the. I say corner, but it's not a corner, is it? There we go. We can fill these up with clothes. Okay. Let's get some fancy furniture in here. Make it look hibbity hop. And one for the. Well, whoever's going to work here, I haven't decided yet. There we go. Bring this back a little bit. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, we just put these shelves down. We've done quite a lot of furniture, but I want to fill these shelves up with clothes to make it look really. Let's push these back to make it look really authentic. I don't want these in the way. Let's put this footrest. Should we put it there? Nah, we'll make it look like it's randomly chucked down. Okay, let's. Uh, shit, we're gonna need some beds up here. Let's open this door. Uh, build mode. Let's get the first bed. Put it over. Mm, nah, let's put it over here. Let's do it this way. Let's put it against the wall. A uh, little desk for paperwork and shit. Now we need. Who's that down there? It's Piper. We'll get a chest of drawers over here somewhere. Uh, let's put it. Let's move it on this one to this wall. There we go. A little bedside table. Table there. Looking good. Okay, let's make this place look a little bit more homely. 
get some pictures going. Uh, you there? This one looks nice and warm, but it's near the bed. There we go. Yep. Okay, now we're going to get some clothes in this shop. Let's. Because I want to place as many as I can on the shelf. Let's test this out before I drop it all though. Let's try this hat first, here we go. <clears throat> Shall I put it on this one? Oh. This is going to be very fiddly. I don't know if there's a way to sort of rotate it, but I'm using the surroundings to get it in the position that I want it to be. Let's put it over here. There we go. <laughs> okay. Let's uh, take another hat. Why are you getting your hammer out? Put it back. Let's put this on the top shelf. I think maybe we should put all the hats on the top shelf. That would make sense. Yeah. Okay, this is the last one. It's looking good. Well, I'll say the last one. We've got actually one more after this one. Let's try and rotate this. There we go. Oh, shit. Nearly. Yes, yes, yes. We got it. Who's that? Preston. He's in the medical center. Let's grab this dress. Uh, we'll put it here on the last shelf. There we go. Yeah, boy. We'll just put these in the. We'll just put these into storage for now. The rest of the. Uh, the rest of the stuff. We can place this in the suitcases. Or, yeah, the suitcases. Okay. Anything I can do to help out around here? Yes. Yeah, let me show you. Okay. I'm going to get this guy to work in the clothes shop. Press A to command. Let's fix him up a little bit before we do. Oh yeah, looking very sharp. <laughs> okay, let's get him in the shop. Is he following? Uh, a sign. There we go. Okay, this is the bar. Which... I don't know. Originally it wasn't going to be a bar, but I'm going to completely rip it down and start again. This is what I've come up with so far. Sort of walk in. Uh, this is the kitchen. I'm going to move this. The kitchen is going to be back here. Uh, that's the bar. One of the bars. I'm going to get two of them and then I'm going to place the the actual bar where is it? over, over here we'll put this right in the middle so it's there as soon as you walk in you see it put it there okay Okay, let's open up the door, show you what I've got so far. You walk in, to your left you've got the tables and chairs. I've actually ran out of material so I couldn't get it the way I wanted to get it. Kitchen area, shelves at the back, some storage units over there. Pool table, got to have a pool table. Two chairs, I was going to put a table in between them but ran out of materials of course. But what I want to do is... 
get some refreshments on the shelves. So beer, blood leaf, drop these, drop these, glowing fungus, nope. Yeah, all the bottles we're going to drop and put them on the shelves and on the side of the bar. There we go. Okay, let's place the first bottle. Okay, here we go. Rotate, rotate. Perfect. Put this over here. Nice and gently. There we go. Okay, we're done, we're done. Everyone's using the bar, it looks good. Yeah. It's a bit dark in here at the minute. Grey Garden, you should go. Whole place is run by robots. Cordsworth. Just a little farming area over here. Wait, what the fuck? Oh my god. I thought you were sucking him off. Okay guys, so there you have it. The uh, We've gone from a base to a, 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 an almost complete settlement. I feel like we've got so much more work to do though, we've got to get so much more buildings up, we want to get more settlers in, we want to make it look absolutely epic. The objective is to outdo Diamond City, we want people to sort of come to this area, Sanctuary Hills, to sort of live out the rest of their lives. Uh, so I just want to thank everyone for watching this series so far, we'll get back onto campaign uh, soon after this episode. But I'm just going to be switching up in between uh, base building and, and campaign and possibly a few free roam episodes as well because there's so much of the land that I have not even explored yet. And I uh, hope you're enjoying the series so far. I'm fucking loving this game. It's absolutely epic in every way. I uh, just want to say thank you to everyone for watching, commenting, liking, supporting this series. Uh, God bless you all. Much love and peace.